And welcome back to Flexible Games, where we are playing Transport Fever. Alright. Well, we are working our way into the system here, and I think I want to try sending construction material over here. Uh, give these, give this area something else to do, uh, and maybe help grow them to the point of demanding more food. So we got this plane coming in here. Only going 98 miles an hour. Uh, yeah, I think, I think it would drop like a stone at 98 miles an hour. Uh, okay, so we've got some cargo in here. We've got 115 more. Uh, I'm not sure if these are set to food only. It's hard to tell. Um, I mean, this plus, I don't, uh, to me, that says that it's reconfigurable. Although here, uh, I'm still not sure. Okay, so one of the things I want to do is I want to add an airport to my construction materials here. Uh, and to do that, let's see, we're going to run this out this way. And I want to put another airport. And I'm just going to go whole hog and build a big one right away. Okay, so this one here connects just fine. Bingo. Uh, number of terminals, I'm going to do three. Right away. So this connects with that just fine. Okay. So I want a line, new line. Uh, this is going to be orange from here to here. And this is going to be called the Pentos Construction Mats. Uh, air. Okay. Okay, I can get rid of uh, this. So, now we're going to be able to deliver construction materials in here. Uh, so, let's set up some aircraft to do just that. And we're going to want construction material. And this is going to be orange. And we're going to do two. And this is going to be Pentos Construction Material Air. Go. Also, we could probably do something similar for over here. Because we're already delivering a ton of stuff up in here. We're delivering to this, this one right here, which has got a ton of industrial coverage. And uh, over here, where are we delivering? Um, we are delivering River Run Food. We are delivering right here. It's got a little bit of, little bit of coverage. Uh, I think we actually have two different lines. Yeah, we have two different lines in here. Where does this one go? Okay, this one just goes to here. But I'm sure we could put a a depot up here and send materials down here. This is a very busy, very busy system right here. But I think it would work well. Especially if we were able to move some materials directly over here underground. Like so. We're going to connect right up here. Okay. So if I delivered... Uh, we're going to do a passenger here. Okay. Where's a good central... Central spot to deliver all these? I think right in here. Okay. I am pretty sure right here is the best bet. So right there. So the trucks will come in. 
drive down, deliver, and then hopefully probably loop back around. So they'll loop back up through this way and then head right back. Uh, okay, so I want to do a new line and this is gonna be orange from here to here. Yep, just like I, just like I thought. Uh, and this is going to be, that is River Run, isn't it? Yeah. R-I-V-R, -R, construction mats. Okay. And let's see about a depot. I've got a depot right here. That, that'll work. Okay, Peter, not Peterbilt, Freightliner. Um, I'm going to do a couple that are set to construction material. And then on the rest of them, I'm going to set as automatic. Oh, so that's two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And so this one is going to be, not King's Landing, uh, River Run construction materials go okay and now I need a new line and this is going to be a darker orange from here to here okay and this is going to be river run twins construction mats air uh, construction air. Okay, and now I need a few by aircraft. Construction material. Darker orange. One, two. River run twins construction air. Go. Engage. So now this thing is slowly building up the amount of construction material that it, it's able to send around. Look at that. We've got a new a new tram. Oh, I can go and replace all my trams that are old. So let's see. Details. Has this gone up? It hasn't yet. Uh, and these, it looks like these are... These suffer from the same issue that the Sitaro actually suffers from, is the texture is too bright, and it washes out the color of what we set it to. Okay, these look, these are looking a little worse for the wear here. 25 years old, King's Landing construction material. Yeah, these are set to Peterbilt. So this is orange Freightliner. Uh, construction material. Okay. Yes. That is King's Landing. And there's one other one. So, yep. Storm's End. Uh, we need to replace. This is set vehicle. This is a darker orange. And set to construction material. Yes. So as soon as they start getting old... Which is probably soon. I'm not sure what the lifespan of the Peterbilts are. Uh, 30 years. So yeah, they're, they're a few years away. But they'll get there. Okay, let's see how we are doing as far as construction materials go. Uh, these are not unloading anything, unfortunately. So we're still a little behind the times on that. Uh, let's speed it back up again. How about up here? Our first construction material. Nope, still not delivering anything. And I really wish vehicle traffic was limited here. Uh, I think I might upgrade these lines. Well, that guy was cruising. Yeah, we're a little 
still a little working on the issue here. So we've got who's coming in? We have Pentos coming in. Do we have any construction? We have 61 uh, about going into Pentos. So this guy should have upgraded. Yeah, look at that. We've doubled the amount of potential product this thing can send. So that increases the amount of stone that we're demanding and it will slowly increase the whole line uh, and eventually hopefully upgrade this. So you can see this is already set up to upgrade in six months because our demand is also higher than our limit. I think that has, I think that plays a part in that too. Not, I'm not 100% sure on that, but I'm, I'm pretty sure. Okay, how about this? This is unloading? No, this is not unloading anything yet. I'm thinking I'm going to need some, I'm going to do a really wide with bus lane upgrade on these. Oh, I cannot, I cannot do it. Um, wow, that is, that's too bad. I can do it here, but not here. It must be. So how about a bus lane on this one? That'll help my trucks a little bit more keep in their, keep the roads, you know, special to the, my trucks. Okay, this thing is flying into, this thing's flying into Pentos to deliver. Ooh, look at that. We've got another one that just took off. That's another Pentos truck or plane. This is the river run. This is the first one here. And we are filling this baby up. Look at that. Beautiful. Let's see where this stuff goes when we drop it off here. So, yeah, we got some construction material going in here. And we got a little bit going over here. So it looks like, yeah, the this this will actually pick up a little bit of construction material. It'll probably drop it off over here because this does cover uh, a little bit of uh, industrial. So this one was successful. Uh, now let's go peek at the next the next one here, uh, and it looks like. The next river run, oh yeah, we got lots and lots of construction material to send in here. And this airport is now becoming pretty busy. This thing had to do a, a flyby. And, I mean, did you even unload anything? Oh yeah, I definitely unloaded something. So all of these trucks, too, need to start getting replaced. Uh, twins food replacement set vehicle. Uh, this is a bright green. Uh, yes. And that's twins food. And this is river run food. Set vehicle, darker green, yes. All right, this guy should be able to come in for a landing now. Drop off his construction material so we can start delivering it to these other cities. Which is nice, uh, once, these, once these trucks start upgrading as well, uh, the whole system will respond because we're probably not. Yeah, we're delivering a fraction of the food these things want. So construction material gives us 15 million. Not too bad. We got a whole another plane landing here ready to drop off a bunch more. Uh, so are these actually. Okay, here's some construction material. Nice. So he's probably food. He's, ooh, he's got construction material. Awesome. 
Ooh, look at that. We have another tram available, I think. Let's uh, replace a tram here. Uh, where I'm pretty sure we have some old, old ones. Oh, yes. Uh, wow, this is a train that's 60 years old. Holy cow, we've got, we still have a steam train working. Wow, okay. Um, replace, set vehicle. We're gonna use, we're so close to being able Let's see, we have, what's the top speed? 81, 137. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna replace this. It's gonna be a bright green with an NSB with a couple, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Uh, yes. Wow, I cannot believe we still have a steam, we still have a steam <laughs> engine going. Ooh, that is uh, rather behind the times here. So he should unload, swap. Thing, there we go. And now this thing will really move fast. There we go. It's a short run, so I'm not too concerned with it. Uh, but it should uh, it should respond in kind. We should have quite a bit of Profit from that road vehicle STRM stone, okay uh, Replacement set vehicle gray uh, Stone Okay uh, Yes our construction material that's very very important and yeah we're, we're making we're gonna making some good money there okay here's our first tram let's cruise in here and see how they're doing and yeah these are these are pretty old these are uh, 50 years old very very old so we're gonna replace and it's gonna be yellow and we're gonna do this long one that's I think that'll be Cool. It'll be, it'll be like sneaking through the city. Um, so where where's the nearest tram that's going to be replaced? Oh, there's the counterclockwise one too. I need to replace that one. Where's our first tram? Come on, there they are. There's one right in here going to be replaced. This will look really cool. This this snaky thing. Ooh, wow, that's huge. Look at that thing, that's so cool. Okay, now for counterclockwise, uh, those are all replaced. So I'm gonna set that back to no. I'm not sure what trams unlock uh, late game. Yeah, this kind of derps out on here, unfortunately, but we won't. We won't mind for now. So we're going to set yes on that. And that should replace there. Good to go. And of course, it holds only 30 people. You'd think something that big would hold more than 30 people. But, you know... What is this one? Okay. All right. Uh, are all these replaced? Okay, we got one left here. And then we need to do Pentos. It looks like... Vehicles. These are all buses. We need to replace... Uh, this is clockwise? Yes. Uh, we are going to replace it with... The Volvo, I think. Oh, no. I'm gonna I'm gonna stick with the new flyer for now, and this is all replaced. So I'm gonna set this one back to no. Close that. These are all getting replaced here. Good to go on that front. Yeah, now we're moving tons and tons of people in Storm's End.
And look at the construction material buildup over here. Look at all that. Not a whole lot going overseas, but we got tons, tons for this area over here. So lots of potential to fill this area in here. <coughs> uh, likewise, I kind of want to set these uh, to replace a little sooner. So we're going to set that to 25% and see. Well, we should be old enough to start replacing all of these. So Twins Food Replacement Freightliner, 25%. So these should, these should all start replacing now, and I'll be able to move a lot more material with these replaced than I was before. Okay, that one didn't. River Run Food, that replaced... Oh, it's still on no. Okay, replace yes, okay. Okay, these were replaced, so I'm going to set those to no. So all of these should start being replaced and upgrading. This one didn't. 25% yes. How old is this? Oh. Oh, man. No. Could have sworn I set this... Crap. Uh, dark green. Yes. That's unfortunate. I just replaced a bunch of old Peterbilts with... Brand new ones. Okay, replace. That's the Freightliner. Yes. Oh, yes. Derp. Derp that one out. Big time. Okay, this one should replace. Good. This one should replace. Good. Now we are moving some material. Some serious material. 16 million for all the food. Train 9 is ready to be replaced. I'm going to hold off on any more trains uh, until such a time where we get the flirts. Yeah, these are all unfortunately replaced. Uh, but I'm going to just set that back to 100% and we're going to just run with it. Uh, and this one's set back to 100%. All right. Well, now we are delivering construction materials via air as well, and these things are just workhorses. Oh, beautiful, beautiful amount that we are being able to push through here, and we're even pushing some more material through. So a lot of food. And these things just refuse to move too much food. Do we... Do we have any food coming down here yet? We got some construction material, so I know the system I know the system sees this line just not just not cooperating with the food. It's unfortunate. All right, well, that'll do it for this episode. So, I thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.